a lot of the users a lot of uh, you out there want to understand what exactly do we need to input into any it security policy when we start to write down these policies so that's why just creating this video to give you a basic understanding of what your information security policy it security policy should contain as minimum okay so these are some of the components that should be a part of the it security policy guys number 1 is access control how you are ensuring access control within your organization what type of controls have you put in place for making sure that there is appropriate access control within the organization after that the second thing is identification and authentication how are you making sure that your users are authenticating are you using two factor authentication are you using smart card login what kind of authentication are you using that is the second thing after that you have data classification what different types of data do you have do you have data classification in place or not do you have any confidential data any public data any sensitive data any critical data what kind of data classifications do you have in place that you have to define after that you have encryption whether you have encryption or not enabled for data at rest data in transit as well as data in processing okay that you have to define after that you have to define what are your remote access procedures how do people remote in what is the protocol is it secured or not after that you have to define acceptable use whether your acceptable use policy is there or not whether you have defined it or not after that you have to define patching how are you ensuring patching for all the infrastructure equipment for all the technology infrastructure that you have after that you have to make sure you have appropriate antivirus protection for malicious code after that you have to ensure you have physical security what kind of controls are there for the physical security after that you have to define your backup cycles what is the plan for off site backup are you ensuring backup taken on a regular basis or not have you tried to restore the backup what is the policy around that after that you have server security are you making sure that all the infrastructure servers that you have are hardened properly or not security hardening is it in place or not after that you have employee onboarding and offboarding procedures these are very important guys whether you have it in place or not after that you have change management procedures whether you have appropriate change management for any infrastructure change for that matter if it happens within the organization do you have change management in place or not all these are critical points for information security policy it security policy now it's up to you whether you want to create all these as separate policies or do you want to create a single policy document with all these aspects in it if you will consider it as a single policy document it will go around 80 to 100 pages easily guys and there is nothing wrong with that let me tell you however from a readability point of view it will be dif difficult for somebody to read it otherwise apart from that there is no harm in that you can do it however if you want what you can do is another way an easy way of doing this is similar to that you know apart from keeping everything together you can segregate guys you can segregate like for example you can create a separate policy for access control you can create a separate policy for acceptable use and mention that in the document stating that here is the link to the access control policy or here is a reference to the acceptable use policy you can do that as well but these are some of the critical components that should be there within your information security policy guys these are some critical inclusions that have to be there whenever you are defining your information security policy or 
IT security policy. I hope this helps for any one out there who is trying to create policy for the first time. Guys, it is very easy. Okay, just give it a shot. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye bye.